This video will step through the specifications of the full line of Monet Lacing Technology MS fasteners, tools required for installing both skived and without skiving the top cover of the belt. The MS-25 is used on belt from 1 8 to 5 16 inch thick and up to 350 pounds per inch of width. The MS-35 is used on belt from 3 16 to 3 8 inch thick and up to 360 PIW. The MS-45 is used on belt from 3 8 to 7 16 inch thick and up to 400 PIW. The MS-55 is used on belt from 3 8 to 5 8 inch thick and up to 600 PIW. The MS-65 is used on belt from 9 16 to 3 quarters inch thick and up to 800 PIW. Tools required for installation are a square, a ruler, utility knife, belt marking pin, a power screwdriver, 18 volts or better, a PZ2 bit, a hammer, and a skiving tool all shown here in this picture. Here we have already ensured that both ends of the belt have been squared and are ready for installing the MS-45 fastener. I have taken the measurements from the belt stop of the fastener to the edge of the fastener. This gives me the area that will be skived. We are preparing the first belt end, skiving the top cover to allow the fastener to set level with or below the top cover of the belt. Having marked the belt, I am now ready to skive the top cover. We are using the PS15 skiver with an adjustable blade. Setting the depth of the blade just above the top ply, ensuring we leave a skim of rubber on the top ply of the belt. Slide the MS fastener on the belt back to the belt stop and center on the belt. Using a hammer, you can close the fastener down onto the belt. You are now ready to install the fastener using an 18 volt power screwdriver with the PZ tube drill bit, continuing to ensure the belt is tight against the belt stop on the fastener. The first side is complete and we can see that the screws have gone through the belt and have fully engaged the nut on the bottom of the fastener. On the second side, we are leaving the top cover on the belt to demonstrate how the tension gained via the screw system allows you to tighten the fastener on the belt without skiving. Following the same steps, we position the fastener centered on the belt and aligned with the first side of the belt. Again, tamping down the fastener on the belt, ensuring the belt is tight against the belt stops on the fastener. Note, it is possible to install the fastener with the cable hinge connecting both sides of the fastener, allowing for a quicker installation. And begin installing the fastener with the screws. Relieve the trailing corners of the belt with the utility knife and lock the cable with a washer if necessary. MS fasteners can be ordered in kits specific to the width and strength of the belt, including the fasteners, the pin, a set of screws aligned to the final thickness of the belt. If skiving, this final thickness is measured after skiving the belt, ensuring the proper screw length. 